pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands. One nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Good morning, RHS. I'm Ashley Ouellette. And I'm Madison Hamilton, and this is your Daily Dose for Monday, April 25th, 2016. Attention juniors, Senior Rec Day shirts are on sale, order forms can be picked up in Miss Comiskey's room, and are due May 25th. Isidore Harris talked to Devin Mara about his visit to Columbia. Devin Mara is one student here at RHS who has had a few interesting experiences uh, in other countries, countries specifically Columbia. Let's take a closer look. Uh, in Columbia, we um, mainly go and help churches, and we go and spread our beliefs to the people of South America. We go with this organization called YWAM, which is Youth with a Mission, and we work with a missionary from Canada who lives in South America. It's specifically for our church, but there's other teams that go just with YWAM. We bring a band and that's how we like connect with a lot of the people. Is uh, like we use a band to get their attention and be like, oh, this is just not some weird seminar, so it's actually like fun. This will be my third year, and I went last year in 2015, and two years before that in 2013, and I'll go again this summer. Like when exactly? Uh, the end of July, July like 15th, another day, I don't remember. So it's like about a week, or? It's, it's two weeks long. Um, my favorite part was probably when uh, the band we played, uh, the band we brought played in an arena, which had like 3,000 people in it. That was pretty fun. It's awesome, Devin. Good luck in July. And back to the anchors. Thanks, Isidore. The following students have been selected to perform in the Michigan Youth Arts Festival Jazz Ensemble. Ben Green with the trumpet and Carter Wagner, bear sax. Honorable mentions, Isidore Harris, alto sax, and Logan Loya, bass. This festival is one of the highest honors in, in the arts a student can receive. Congrats, boys. April 27th in room A178B at 3 p.m. is a showing of the movie Do You Believe Popcorn, Popcorn is Free and Everyone is Welcome. Acapella Choir took an excellent number one rating at the MSVOA State Choral Festival. Congratulations, all choir members. Be sure to purchase some Bass Club apparel from Wine.Tees and help support your fishing bears. Juniors, don't forget that Parents College Night is tomorrow from 6.30 to 8 in the RHS Cafe. Attention seniors, prom tickets are selling until Wednesday. Don't miss your chance to participate in the night of a lifetime. Mural drawings are still being accepted. If you're interested, see your English teacher or Miss Stiles for more details. Come visit Shop Hall to see all their latest creations. <laughs> Now let's go to Ashley Chapel for your sports report. Hey there, IHS. I'm Ashley Chapel, and this is your daily sports report. Trek was at Allen Park Friday, and also they have a track meet tomorrow at Trenton. JV Soccer had a game against Riverview on Friday. Varsity and JV Softball had a game on Friday against Woodhaven. More on those tomorrow. That's all for your sports report. Now back to the anchors. Thanks, Ashley. Happy birthday to Bianca Della Garza and Allison LaMonica. Hey, Madison, did you hear about the English teacher who went to jail? No, what happened? She got a full sentence. <laughs> <laughs> I've been Ashley Alette. And I've been Madison Hamilton. Stay, Stay punny, RHS. RHS.